just download it, you know, and that's basically a similar list. Now you can just go ahead and use any font on that entire website. What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome to a new After Effects video guys. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to add custom fonts. I received a lot of comments from people like, dude, can you show me how to add custom fonts into After Effects? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So I would say, let's get started. All right guys, so we are on After Effects right now and I'm going to show you guys how to install some, you know, some custom external fonts outside of After Effects. So it's going to be really easy. So what you want to do is, it's really simple. You just want to go to Google and what you want to do is you want to type in that phone over that font and you want to click on dafont.com basically this is a website where you can get absolutely 100% free fonts uh, you can install right away and use uh, right away also um, so I'm just going to pick a nice font that I like so you can see all different categories right here on all those all those um, you know columns so what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna to go to the basic tab and I'm just going to click on uh, like I would say variation and let's see what kind of fonts we have as you guys can see we have the black ops uh, well you have the Call of Duty as you can see fonts and we have so many other different fonts so let's say I'm just going to pick um, which one should I I'm, I'm, just, I'm just gonna pick this one Queen of Camelot so what we want to do is when you find the font that you like when to download this you just click on the font and you can also type in uh, your name or your text so you can see what it's what it what's going to look like so if I type in my name you can see how it is going to look that's really awesome so when you're like satisfied with the font you just want to go to the right and you want to click on download and then this is going to open up in your downloads right away you want to open this with uh, with like WinZip and then what you want to do in this folder is you want to choose the text one which is this one and then you want to click on install and then it's basically it is installing so right now the font is actually installed so we're going to keep in mind the name of the font which is queen of camelot so we're going to go back to after effects right now right here and we're going to add in a new text so what we're going to do is we're going to right click on this section as you can see right there new text boom and then you can see we can type in the screen so i'm just going to type in just alex halford boom so to, in order to change the text you just want to select everything and on the right as you can see we have our font we have the size everything so what you want to do is you want to in this box you want to type in the name of the font which was queen of camelot boom and as you guys can see right here this is the font that we just installed that is basically how it is similar is that is how you um, install custom fonts is that easy you just want to create a new text file you want to type in on the right as you can see we have typed in Ke Queen of Camelot because that's that's the name of the font we just downloaded you know and that is basically similar list now you can just go ahead and use any font on that entire website download it and install it straight away and now you can use this font in your future projects so that's how easy it is guys that's how you install a custom font in After Effects make sure to let me know in the comments what you think of this video I'll be happy to reply to you so thank you guys for watching that's it for the video guys there's nothing more to tell you guys I showed you everything and that is basically how you install custom fonts so that's what it is guys that's how you add custom fonts to uh, after effects so thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to smash the like button down below and, and guys thank you so much for the continued support on the 24 hour live stream in that stream we almost reached 3,000 people on that entire stream that's freaking amazing guys thank you guys so much for the donations and everything else for staying up all night with us to so just to you know to enjoy the stream i'll be going live more often on youtube so keep an eye on my channel for more future streams make sure to smash the subscribe button down below and i will see you guys actually in two hours the last video so i would say i will see you guys in two hours in about uh four episodes it's going to be the 22nd of may and then i find something else when i started using video editing software it was like i have my own patreon page you have fucking troll channelpages.com kind of nice weather and i'm a tight with just alex Halford. you know it's his channel so that's a bit of a logic